What is up guys, welcome back to the solo series on my channel, I'm gonna grab this node while I talk to you here. Oh my god, prepare yourselves for the biggest update to ever hit Rust as we know it. As you'll see, I'm not gathering XP right now, I'm not getting levels and that's because this is the first day, this is wipe day, this is literally the wipe hit 30 seconds ago, we just loaded in and ran up this hill because we are now playing on the component system. The XP system is gone! Gone, it's gone, it's gone, it's gone. We don't have BPs, we don't have XP anymore. Basically, the component system, if you've been living under a rock for the last few months and you don't know what the component system is, basically everybody slated the XP system for being so linear and it just being sort of the same experience over and over and over again, which I get, it was. So basically now with the component system, we can craft everything straight off the bat. We know everything, but they've introduced a whole load of new components for you to use to craft everything making things much more difficult to craft. So to get these components, we've got to hit up rad towns, barrels, shit like that. So the way we like to build, boys, the way that we like to build on the edges of the map, nice and far away from everybody, going out and finding people. No, we can't do that anymore. We need to build close, close to everyone involved. The beauty of this system is going to be that we can actually build things like a bow and shit like that straight off the bat. The fuck was that? Oh, it's a deer. So, as long as we can get some cloth, we can actually build a bow straight the way. Oh, and this right here, this is something else that they just put in. This is incredible. What a lucky find. This is a trash pile right here. These are going to spawn boxes, barrels, just sort of loot crates, all of that jazz. So, hopefully, we can get some good stuff in it. What have we got in there? A metal blade. All right, so this is one of the new components right here, metal blades. So we're gonna use that to make things like machetes and swords and stuff like that, which is pretty damn cool. What I'm thinking we're gonna do is maybe grab some wood for some spears. I've already got 50 that I picked up. There's a guy chilling there. Let's go and have a say hey. Hello there, friend. Hello. It's all right, Wolfie. Goodbye. I'm sorry. Somebody else coming. Why do people run? All I have is a rock. All I want to be is friend. <gasps> There's a rad town over there, lads. We're going to have to head that way, aren't we? Towards the desert. You guys said in the last episode, well, not the last episode, the last series, I asked you well, where you guys wanted me to build, because obviously it's, it's you're watching me. You guys should uh, have a say. Oh, a lighthouse too. And basically, you said the snow. Now, the snow is kind of going to be a bit problematic for us around here because we're in the desert right now. Has this guy got anything? Junk Norris? No, you don't. So I'm going to head that way, I think, because this desert spawns look the lighthouse over there. Hello there. Hello. Okay, so that looks like the train station over there right now. And then we've got this tasty road. So the road's going to lead us to the light. There's a guy here. Hello there. Hello, friend. Hello. Bruh. No. Hmm. Fucking cocksucker! Alright, we've got some more components in there, boys. Take that spear as well. Does that give us two spears? No, just the one. Where's this other one? I wasn't going to kill him! This was just all about being nice and friendly, a bit of friendly banter on wipe day. No. Apparently not, according to that guy. Let's head out this way. To be honest, guys, I'm thinking we could probably put some roots down pretty, pretty damn sharpish. This is looking very nice area around here. We're close to a couple of raddies. Nice in the desert. I wanted to build in the snow this white, but to be honest, if we could get a base down nice and sharpish, look at all these fucking resources. This is awesome. Oh, there's a guy here. Oh, he's not dead. Fucking hell. Fucking hell's bells, guys. He's not fucking dead. I'm going to have to try him. Oh, I've missed. I've got to pick up his spear. Oh, I've got to take this guy. Go on, throw. Oh, he's missed again. I think I got it. Did I get it? Oh, he got me. Fuck. I've got both spears in me, though. Have I? No. No, I don't. Fucking hell, this is a shit show. Oh, let's get his spear. All right. Oh, he killed me! Fucking son of a bitch! Oh, okay. We'll start again. Hello, friend. Oh, why? You just saw me spawn, you stupid cunt. Go on. Okay. 
Or people on this fu- Oh, here he is. Is this him? This is fucking him. Yeah, you stupid dick. Yeah! You better fucking run. You're the scum of the earth. The damn scum of the earth. Yeah, you better run. Oh, you're not going to chop that body up too, bro? You don't want that one? Nah, you just wanted me. My nice juicy flesh. Yeah, come on. Bring it. Bring it on. Come on. Dare ya. Dare ya. My rock will take you, bro. My rock will destroy you. Well, that was fun. Let's go this way. This is actually the fucking spawn we had a minute ago, actually. So many dead people everywhere. Okay, guys, so we're back where we, uh, where we just were. But there's a box here, which has a spring in it. Okay, that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Let's see if we can get out of some of these back. <gasps> Another box. Oh, my God. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Let's hope there's something good in this one. Because these barrels are just giving me bloody wood these days. Another spring. Do they stack? Okay, at least they stack. That's a start, Russ. That's a start. Oh, you done fucked up now, boy. Oh, and then a wolf came. What? <laughs> Okay guys, so I've managed to make it to the other side of the train station where my spawn was just down there. So what I've done is I've gathered a little bit of hemp and a little bit of wood and I've got literally nothing left. And I've thrown a bag here because I'm seeing a few animals. There's a pig there, a couple of nodes over there. There's also a little base over here. Base is on wipe day. Maybe we can get something out of this. Ooh, please come on weapon, please come on weapon. Oh, I don't want whatever the hell that is. All right then, lads. So this is actually looking like quite a nice area. I've got a rad town just over there. The sats are pretty far in the distance. There's so many nodes. My bag I just put down is just over there. There's a little base over there, which I rolled over and I made friends with the guy. And this area down here is a little bit flat. So what I'm thinking is we are going to throw down our TC. Okay, we have a wooden TC down in this area and a bag over there. There's a deer here. Hello darkness, my old friend. I've come to talk with you again. Oh god. I'm so sorry. I'm so so sorry to everyone that watches this video. Alright guys, so as it's coming into night time, just give you a brief little look at what we've got going. We've got this. This beautiful, majestic thing here. And oh, don't laugh at me. Don't laugh at it. Don't laugh at it. It's great. It's great. So, this is it. Triangle, square, couple of doors. What it's going to be is that we're going to put the large furnace just here. So this is going to be my door to access my furnace. Then this is going to be my door around it. But you've got to plan for these things nice and far ahead, you know? So... It's just a case of what I'm going to do is throw a door on there when I've got a small furnace in here to begin with. But I need loads more animals. I've stashed most of our shit, or everything that I could fit, into two. Fuck. Oh, it's a horse. I've not got my spear anymore. I threw it at a guy and he ran off. Son of a bitch. Don't run, horse, please. <laughs> I want to kill you. <laughs> if I can get some cloth down, I could make a boat. Someone's building over there. Holy shit, someone's building over there. I might need to roll in there with a couple of spears and see what I can do here. Holy shit, have I got anything to lose? Yeah, everything to lose. But also, everything to gain, guys. Everything to fucking gain. Guys, there's a fight going on here. Maybe we could counter-raid some shit here, who knows. There's a guy chopping a tree just here. Maybe I take that guy out first? Oh my god! There are so many guys here. Well, I missed, didn't I? Ah, oh, he's got a fucking bow! I didn't even want that shit! Oh, there's like five of them. I can't... Jesus Christ! Ugh. That is annoying. I can't take five of them, boys. I didn't think there was that many. Alright guys, so we've actually developed a little bit of a community which is actually forming on this little makeshift island thing. There's obviously the nice neighbours over there, there's some more neighbours just over there which are building just, let me show you, just there as you can see. We've got that big clan over there though which is going to be an issue in time, I can guarantee you that. So tell me down in the comments what you guys think about the component system, are you guys enjoying it, do you prefer the XP system? I don't think many people did like the XP sort of way of doing it, the grind if you will. I think a lot of people like the BP stuff to begin with. I'm quite liking this way of doing things, not that I've needed to 
really make anything major yet though. That's the big thing here. Tomorrow, when I've got a little bit more stuff, there's plenty of junk piles and shit around. I'm gonna, I think, try and kill this horse perhaps. Yeah, look, there's loads of these junk piles around, which is nice. So that means that I can grab all of those and just keep getting a nice, decent supply of stuff. Holy shit, there's a fucking pig there. He's having an absolute scarper, but there's an absolute pig here, and I'm just so excited. Come here. Ah. Ah. Oh my god, guys. This is the first pig we've seen in a while. The base is coming along quite nicely, actually. It's going quite well. All I've done, really, is I've done a little bit of farming. Well, not even farm that much, to be honest. I'll give you a quick peruse. Why is there an arrow in this? Well, that's that's not that's not good. That's not why. Why was there an arrow in the? Ah, oh, back to the base we go. This is the base. Here she blows. This is what we're rocking inside. Got our furnace cooking, which is cooking up a lot of metal frags right now. Actually, we need to put a little bit more wood in there. And then we've got this large chest, but we need to get a proper airlock down. So this is actually going really, really well. We could probably. I think we've actually got enough for a large furnace, or at least another furnace if we fancied. Just gonna throw this down, throw that on. Beautiful. We've got an airlock, lads. We've got an airlock, that's lovely, okay. I'm probably gonna go to sleep, because I don't think there's enough here for you guys. I think it's been pretty boring, kinda lame, not, not much has really happened, so probably gonna go to sleep if we haven't been raided. It's straight off to the trade station tomorrow, hopefully we can get some gun crates, get some good shit. But I shall catch you all in the morning when hopefully we haven't been raided. Alright then guys, so I've just logged back on and we have surprisingly not yet been raided. I've just thrown a tiny bit of wood in these furnaces. We've got so many metal frags right now. I mean, this is pretty pretty damn fucking nice for like, I don't know how long I played last night, a couple hours. Nothing too major. It has been around about 24 hours since I was just on. We've got a few more bits. This is everything we're rocking right now. Nothing too great. We need a few more components. There was literally just somebody outside right now. So I'm a little bit conscious of going out with them out there, but I'm thinking we go for a little bit of an explore. I'm not too... Yeah, I'm going to leave my tools behind. We're going to take a spear, a stone, pick this hatchet thing. We're going to head over to the Rad Town, I think. Going to go and see what's guanin' over there, maybe get some components if we can. Oh my god, what the fuck? Well, holy shit, that base has popped up, hasn't it? Jesus Christ, I need to go and see if that's the friendly neighbour. Okay guys, so it's looking as though this base here is his neighbour's friend. Just here. So that over there was his resource base. That little thing, fucking hell. Oh, I really want to go and steal stuff from that furnace. My god. I should not have built here. I should not have built here, this was a mistake. My whole life is a mistake, guys. I don't know what I've done with it. This is what we're rocking right now. There's a clan over there, that wasn't there last night. Oh my god, this is the moral of this story is guys, do not go off in Rust, because you need to use every waking second to build up. Jesus, look at that. Okay guys, so I'm probably going to call the video there, mainly because I need to go and fart them now to try and catch up with those fucking guys, because that is insane. My god, and they will have taken all the nodes here, so I don't know how I'm going to go and find some nodes. Jeez, I'm going to have to travel really pretty far for those. So that is pretty lame. But anyway, thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed the first episode. It was a bit of a slow one, but that's kind of just getting used to the component system. I didn't really have too much time to play. So what I'm going to do now is farm, 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 and hopefully we can get some decent action going for you in the next episode. But if you enjoyed it, if you could hit that like button, that would be incredible. If you wanted to subscribe to the channel, we are so close to 3,000 subscribers. Do you know how insane that is? I was literally only just thanking you guys for 2,000, and we're almost about to hit 3K. So if we could just get another few subscribers to hit that 3k that would be incredible so thank you so much for watching have an awesome day have an awesome week i'll catch you all in the next video which hopefully has some action maybe some raids who knows the world is our oyster have an awesome day guys